Hey y'all, I'm Stephen Baldacino. Hi, I'm Kimolina Baldacino. Uh, Stephen and I have been together for nine years, been married for three years. We live out at Hazelwood North, a little country town in Victoria, um, formerly known as uh, Gippsland. By day I work full time uh, as a plumber and gas fitter. I work in our local power station, which is at Hazelwood Power Station. I've uh, been working there for about three to four years. I work full time in administration at GDF Sewers Law and B. I've been there for six years. Um, in our spare time, we're professional fighters. In my 18 fights, I've claimed two East Coast titles, a state title, and two Australian titles, and the current WKA Australian kickboxing champion. I have a fight record of eight fights, four wins, two draws, two losses. I'm the current IKBF Victorian champion. Uh, Kim and I both go up at about 4.30. Uh, fortunate enough to have our own gym at home, so yeah, we're down in the gym. Uh, we usually train for about half hour, 40 minutes before work. And then yeah, off to work for the day. After work, we're both lucky enough to finish work at 3:30 at the same time. So we both meet each other at home, get all our gym stuff ready, then we're straight in the car down to Melbourne, uh, where we train for an hour and a half. Training under Mark, it's great. You know, every training session is different. Always pushing us to our limits. He helps out not only yeah with the kickboxing training, but all my strength and conditioning, my diet, everything. Um, without Mark, I wouldn't be where I am today. Training with Mark's like um, I don't think we ever trained with anyone quite like Mark. He focuses a lot on uh, strength and conditioning work. Very good with his pad work. Um, yeah, he's just just like someone I've never trained with before. Hi, I'm Mark Ivar. Head coach of the IAP gym, um, the strength and conditioning coach. Been working with professional athletes and more co's, primarily with fighters, um, none more so than Steve and Kim. Um, I've been very privileged to have them in my stable and haven't looked back. Uh, what I saw in Steve and Kim was um, that desire, that desire to be better, uh, better than they were maybe yesterday or better than you know, the competition. Um, they always strive to, to wanting to do better and ne never really were content on just standing still. So um, they're, I guess, great exponents of that and have been the forefront runners of the gym since our inception. And uh, I can't express just how proud I am to have them here in, in this gym. I got involved in martial arts through my sister. Uh, she wanted to go and try out Taekwondo. I didn't really want to, I wasn't very interested at all. But being a good sister, I went along with her and she actually didn't like it and I loved it, so I stuck with it. I began my training when I was about 12 years old. Uh, I first started in martial arts in a karate style called Tang Soo Do. Uh, just as a young age, I was always fascinated with, with uh, action movies, you know, martial arts. So yeah, I was lucky enough to get a start at a young age. Being a professional fighter, there's a lot of sacrifices. Um, family's a big part of my life. I love them. Um, they're always there for me, support me, everything that I do. Yeah, I guess um, our family is probably uh, a strong backbone for our training because they're so supportive. Um, if we didn't have such a good family, we wouldn't be probably where we are today. Uh, with Kim, you know, she works hard. She definitely works hard. She's a taskmaster. She's here. You know, she also sometimes pulls the reins on, on some of the guys here. You know, you know, trying to lift their game. Um, I feel as though that you know, you know. In, a year or two, maybe so. You know, she'd be looking to, to press her claim as being, an, you know, an icon of the sport, you know, and a household name. So, you know, look out for Kim. His first win at uh, Kings of Combat was, you know, you know, brought back, you know, Steve of old, you know, and we all know Steve can, you know, can bang with the best, you know, can um, ruffle the feathers of some of the top around the world as well. So, you know, this shows you just how well he can, you know, put it together on his day. Uh, not too many people will be standing, you know, on the other side with a W when Steve's in front of them. Uh, this year I'd like to defend my IKBF K1 Victorian title and then hopefully go for the Australian title. I'm feeling fitter, stronger than ever, so bring on 2015. Uh, March 21st guys, Immortality, it's going to be my hometown Trelgan. Uh, Joey from New Zealand, it's going to be on mate. 